the Element 99 spread all over the island and left traces on things. So because the TMD is tied directly to Element 99, only the things that are touched by E99 can I, can I manipulate. I see. In this particular case, I'm actually trying to catch a rocket here and failing miserably, but I just did it and threw it back at him really quickly. It stops in time and I can, uh, oh, I can toss it back. Grenade. So here's a grenade. I caught oh. that in midair. I throw oh. it back at him. And it'll blow up behind him. Nice. Now one thing I can do here, he's actually getting up. Uh, I can show off the E99 pistol. So this allows me to aim down sight and steer the bullet in whatever direction I want. So I have absolute control over that. Um, he's taking cover again, but I can get behind his cover and take him out with a very critically steered bullet. So the last thing here that I want to show off to you guys is the fact that, here, I'll just rebuild this and grab some ammo from it. Um, this is our, uh, these are our platforms. These are our TMD amplifiers, if you will. So what they do is allow me to amplify the TMD. And they charge in and hook in. Kind of a one-shot deal, but I need to get through this building in front of me. In order to do so, I need to restore it to its former glory. The only way I can do that is using these amplifiers. So when I hook in, it actually upcharges my TMD and I'll restore it to the way it was in 1950. Okay. Looks pretty cool. Usually you're destroying buildings, not having to rebuild exactly. them. Exactly. <laughs> it's a, nice it's reversal. a very Yoda moment. You feel, you feel very, very empowered. Very much the right? force. And we have a, cool, uh, a handful of really cool opportunities like this in the, in the player's uh, arsenal where they can affect really large epic scale things. It's really nice and you see like that's my first time so yeah. I'm clearly pretty He's satisfied. Look at his hand, yeah, check, me check out, it right? out. So um, I'm going to walk into the building and what you'll quickly notice is that large items like this, unlike the smaller things that I was manipulating with the TMD, they actually age forward really quickly. So they don't hold for very long. Um, they keep the player moving so in this case, you know, things are coming down around me, the paint's peeling live, yeah. this, this bridge is collapsing. Uh, so I so need to if you move. you were to stand in that place, like right now, just stand there and not move, that whole building would collapse around you and it's, you'd die? It's definitely coming down, right. so I need to get moving. All right. So what I'm doing is uh, I need to take out a couple enemies here. I'll just age this guy really quickly. See him turn to dust right in front of me. That's always fun. Uh, I'll open this door and get out of the building as quickly as possible. As I step outside, so the last thing we have to showcase is, let's talk about the island. As you move from the outer edge to the inside, you'll notice that things get weirder and weirder. This is some of the flora that's been affected by E99. This is some of the life that's been affected by the E99. These are actually the parasites that create those zacks. And as you move in further and further, you discover there's weirder and weirder things going on. Very cool. Well, I think we're running out of time. Anything you want to touch upon that we might have missed? or? Uh, I just would like to say that we're coming out on Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, and PC. We'll be out sometime this year, and, uh, and we're really looking forward to getting out there for you guys. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Looks like quite the trip. Don't go anywhere. We've got even more E3 goodness for you, including the latest Wii game from High Voltage. Keep hitting refresh, guys. We'll be back in a jiffy.